What is going on, Box Bros? It is the Box Man here, and welcome to the 30th monthly Budokai giveaway tournament. Only one lucky competitor is going to walk away with the 100 bucks tonight, as always, guys. So let's see who's it going to be. What's up, Steve? What's up, Pixel? What's up, Mitch? Welcome, everybody. HK. Oh, that's the automated mesh. I'm sure he's probably here. Uh, how you doing, Mitchie? Thank you for the like spike. You two Pixa. Welcome, guys. Steve as well. Appreciate all the like spikes, guys. Uh, so, yeah. Who's going to win the money tonight, baby? We'll find out. <laughs> What's up, Stable? Okay, so let's look at the bracket. First match. Uh, lot, uh, Only one seed. Only one seed. There's actually not too many competitors uh, this time. Only 15. So we got the box man, myself, versus Vegeta. Oh my god, GG versus Mitch right off the bat in the preliminary match. Oh my goodness. This is gonna this is gonna be intense. This is going to be inside some tents. We got some tents set up by the ring, you know. They're gonna be fighting at them, just kidding. I don't know, I'm trying to make a joke. But anyway, so we got the box man, me baby, with breakthrough, mixed blood power, key control, and uh, Videl's kiss. You don't know what a hammer is? Gohan's you know, not gonna be happy about this hammer. one, guys. He's, he's not gonna be happy about this. What up, Tamba? <laughs> and then we got Vegeta with the double shit. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold on. <laughs> All right, box man with that stuff. Uh, Vegeta with breakthrough, ultimate power, and Saiyan spirit. All right, GG versus Mitch, right off the bat, in the preliminaries. Let's freaking do it. Good luck, guys. Uh, round round one, match one is beginning. This is the match to watch at this tournament. Thank you for the like, Spike Tomba. Uh, I just have no clue how to set up these builds, so I'm content to watch. <laughs> you didn't enter, Steve? Did you enter? No, I guess you didn't enter. You, you gotta enter, man. Like, whether you do a build or not, like, you know, it's... All right. It's better than no chance at all, you know? Come on, freak. Can't win if you don't enter. Oh, yeah. The box man, I still can't get over how the box man is in Budokai. And right now, I'm getting my ass whooped by Vegeta, so it's not looking too good. How the hell did I let myself get hit by that when I got so much K? Just do Breakthrough and hope. <laughs> breakthrough only costs three now, so... Ooh, that was good. Oh, shit. Oh, that was a good juggle. Damn! All right, now I'm coming back, baby. Now we're coming back, baby. Oh, nice alley oop attempt there. Oh, no choice. Here comes the fucking dragon rush. Oh, you bitch, Vegeta! You son of a bitch! And Vegeta doing hella damage to me right now, though. Good lord. This ain't looking good, JJ. I'm trying my best for you, dude. I'm trying. Vegeta is so powerful. Oh, I'm done. Oh, God. That's not good. If Vegeta gets Super Saiyan 4, like, we're fucking finished. Oh, God. Oh, that was a good block. That was a good block. Uh-oh. Oh! What's up, Vegeta? Oh, fuck. Oh, what's up, Vegeta? <laughs> what's up, Vegeta? What's good, my dude? Oh no. Oh no. I'm done, dude. I'm fucking done. Oh, he's trying for his ultimate. Oh, missed me. Nice try, Vegeta. <laughs> oh man, I'm sorry, Mitchy. Oh, I missed the raging kick. No. You see that Ollie open to a juggle, too? That was great. Oh, there's the raging kick. Come on, GG, we got this, baby. We got this, GG. Cross your fingers. Cross them, baby. 
Oh, look at these raging kicks, dude. Oh, this is what I've been waiting for. I'm sorry, Mitch. I I'm sorry if it looks like I'm rooting against you, but I mean... It's, it's, uh, it's basically, it's literally me in the game, man. How can I not root for me in the game? Come on. Oh, nice try, Virginia. See you later. Okay, this could still go either way, though. Oh. It's the raging, raging kick again. Vegeta's down to his last health bar. Can he come back? Oh. Wow. With one Gallic gun, he's almost brought it back. Shit, GG. This could still go either way, my, my dude. I'm scared. Mitch is, Mitch is gonna whoop out the frickin' voodoo magic to make himself win like he always fucking does. Oh! Oh my god! It's over! It's fucking... That was an insane first match, dude. <laughs> Should've stayed lost. Should've stayed lost, dude. <laughs> that was a great first match, wasn't it? Oh my god. All right, well, looks like I'm going on to face the only seed in the second round. Better luck next time, Mechie. I'm sorry, dude. I'm just too powerful for you. I'm just too powerful. Next up, we got Omega Shinron versus Nappa. That's Tamba uh, versus Nappa. <laughs> yes, of course, of course, Nappa would pick Nappa. You know, like, of course. It only makes sense, right? Jeez, Mechie. All right, we got Omega Shinron with Black Dragon Ball, Shadow Dragon's Hide, and Appetites of Man. His health is decreased by two because he's so freaking OP. And then we got Nappa with just the breakthrough. This should probably be a walk in the park for old Timby, but uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. You never know. Why did he blow Super Saiyan 4 by ulting twice? Ah, sometimes the bots do that, man. They just do that sometimes. That's just the way it be, you know? Not much can be done. Wait, so you got rid of the ring out phase? Um, no, it, phase one is always preliminaries, and then everything else after that is uh, ring outs. Like it's, we, we, we always do preliminaries in the beginning, and then... And preliminaries are down to straight brawn. So, like, you know, if you if you wanna if you wanna survive the preliminaries, guys, or have a really good chance of surviving, you gotta do them builds. Check out the Patreon, only five bucks a month, guys. You can become a 20 plus member and do a build for your guy. Which gives you a much, much, much greater chance of winning. I've done the math, it's roughly 34.2% chance uh, increase of winning if you do a build. Sometimes more depending. But average, you know, average. Damn, poor Nappa, dude. <laughs> See, this is what I mean, guys. Yeah, oh, he tried for that ultimate, but missed. Yeah, unless you build like Steevil and just don't even enter at all, then your chance is zero. I think, uh, I don't think you gotta work. Oh my! Okay, um. <laughs> don't hold your breath, Timby. <laughs> See! I love it, dude. Well, goodbye, Timby. <laughs> It'd be really funny if I did, um. I did a tournament where if somebody gets an ultimate like that off, you just lose automatically. <laughs> like, the ultimate kills you. Well, our preliminary ring has been destroyed by Nappa, of course. Did you expect any less? And maybe I'll do something like that in the future, call it the ultimate meta. And everybody would have an ultimate on their build, of course. Like, everybody would have to. I 
I don't know. What do you guys think? Give me uh, initial opinions in the chat. Oh, there goes Nappa. He did. Not even a scratch. <laughs> he did. Alrighty, Tombies moving on to the next one. Better luck next time, Nappa. Okay, next up we got Kid Goku versus Yamcha. That's Lord Aizen versus Ledeb. Is this the match to watch at this tournament? Probably not. Alright. Sounds good, really? Oh yeah, Cyberman. No, it'd have to be an ultimate, like, okay, I'd list the ultimate. It's gotta be an ultimate that, like, shows the side of the Earth and, like, an explosion coming off of it. It's gotta be one of those, like, uh, arena-destroying ultimates. It's gotta be one of those. Not just, like, a self-destruct thing. You know what I mean? It's gotta be, like, Final Flash, Big Bang Attack. Uh, y you know, something like that. So, that that's what I meant. Anyway, Kid Goku, we got with uh, the Breakthrough, no build, and Yamcha with no build. All right, let's go. Hello there, how you doing, Jedi Gamer? Welcome to the tournament. Do you have a horse in this race, Jedi? Did you sign up? No, you didn't. You did not. Oh, yeah, you just rejoined the Discord, didn't you? Sign up for next month, Jedi. You can win 100 bucks, bro. 100 bucks! Happy Tuesday! Yeah, we do the tournaments on the first month. Uh, on the, or sorry, the first Tuesday of every month. Maybe I can beat this Goku. <laughs> Wait, I don't think I've ever seen that interaction before. Oh my goodness! Yeah, because Yamcha and Goku fight. You know, in Dragon Ball, it's like one of the first fights in all of Dragon Ball. And Yamcha actually beats Goku, but it's only because Goku's hungry. He's beating him right now, too. Oh, damn. Alright, Goku's getting serious now. You didn't sign up yet? You'll sign up for next month's tournament? Alright, man. That's funny. It's like Yamcha missed his ultimate, and then Goku does like a leap over him. Are we having an Ahsoka watch party tonight? <laughs> I don't do watch parties. I don't do that. Maybe maybe one day I'll do something like that, but... When I have like 10 times more subscribers, I'll do something like that for sure. If that ever happens. I haven't even started watching it yet, man. I just haven't... I've been so busy, I haven't been able to get to it. Wow! That was, uh, that was pretty good. You'll be watching, Stable. I'll show you my secret weapon. Do you guys want to see the box man's secret weapon? Let's turn it up. Yeah, I'm gonna try. I mean, you know, the one good thing about like not watching the show back to back is that I'll probably have a bunch of episodes, you know, to binge. Not that I'll probably have enough time to binge them, but... <laughs> You're in love with Sabine. Interesting. I mean, she's alright. Well, misses the spirit ball again. You ready? Oh, here comes the wolf fang fucking fist! Ah, oh, he couldn't finish it. Goku's almost got a two health bar lead on him, it looks like, so. Oh man, man, now he's really got a two health bar lead. The new girl? Are you talking about that Dark Jedi chick? Hey, Nabet! Nabet is here! You finally brought the pizza, Nabet! We've been waiting! Thank you for the like, Spike. Good to see you. Nabet is in the house. Everybody say hi to Nabet. 
Dan just spamming the power pole on his fucking penis. Jesus. It's over. This is done. Oh. Oh! That was a nice grapple. Yamcha ain't giving up yet, dude. He's literally got a speck of how. Okay, he's done. That's it. <laughs> uh, I'm hungry now. Whew, if only he got a little hungry sooner, maybe Yamcha could have pulled through. But, alright. Better luck next time, Ladeb. Lord Eisen's moving on. Next up, we got Freezy Pop versus Goten. That's Katie versus Merlin. Oh my god, Katie, you were just in time for your match. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? Holy shit, okay. We got Frieza with the breakthrough and Frieza's spaceship. Oh, and because of Frieza's spaceship, got to decrease the health. And Goten with the fusion. Merlin is really trying to get that fusion off, dude. Tries it every week. Every week. Will it work this time? He had, we, <laughs> he had to get that turtle wave in there. Good old turtle wave, bro. What? More little monkeys? Aha! This is gonna be fun! I didn't know that I'm seeing all these uh, interactions that I've never seen before. Goten is a little monkey, dude. Uh oh. Oh! Puts him into a dragon rush instead of going for the fusion. What is wrong with Goten, dude? This could turn out to be a really good fight, though. Like, Mecha Frieza versus Gotenks? I mean, that'd be fucking sick. <laughs> that'd be so cool. I'm hoping we say it. Uh-oh. Goten, he goes hyper and just blows it every time. I'm very surprised that Freeze is staying in his second form, too. This is a very strange fight so far. <laughs> Freeze is probably going to win this if uh, Goten can't get off the fusion. Because he's still got the spaceship. Uh oh. It's only going to get harder for Goten now. Goten was just testing Freezer. Oh boy. Wow, like Goten doesn't even go for the fusion. He's not even trying. You think the bot would be inclined to like go for it when it's a fusion. Oh shit, full power Freezer. God damn, Goten's dead, dude. He's so dead. Frieza might not even have to go fucking Mecha. Attack win, damn, dude. Ah, oh, poor Goten. I like Manon. I love Manon too. Definitely my favorite planet. 
Even if he went go ten now or go tanks, it. it... Yeah, go ten's completely done. He had a few opportunities to at least attempt to do the fusion, but he just didn't do it. This is why it's a wild card because like. If you get off the fusion, your chances of winning are, like, almost guaranteed. But you just gotta hope that the bot will do the fucking fusion. Yeah, Frieza didn't even need to go mecha. You disappoint me. Da yes! Big disappointment, because I really want to see go tanks, but oh well. Alright, sorry Merlin. Better luck next time. Alright, Katie, you're moving on! Check it out, Katie. You see, you can win. All right, next up, we got Kid Boo versus Android 18. That's Papa Scoops versus Darth Revan. Is this the match to watch at this point? Is this the one? I think it might have already passed. All right, we got Kid Boo with Breakthrough, Demon Realm, Flames, and Bobbity's Guard. Or is that? Yeah, it's Bobbity's Guard. And then we got Android 18 with Breakthrough, Rage Times 3, and Sirius 1. Very interesting. Here we go. Just hearing the fish people noises in my head now. Get lost, the eyesore. <laughs> try, try. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh boy. So I'm gonna say Kid Boo's probably got this one. But then again, 18's AI can be pretty goddamn crazy. I, wait, I, I did. I broke into the Sith HQ before entering Manon, didn't get the evidence against them. No charges were given, and I couldn't progress. Oh, that sucks. It was funny, honestly. The save reload wasn't too bad. I like Manon's choice uh, making. Yeah, th that's the thing I like about Manon the most, too. Oh, my God. Here comes the warp Kamehameha. The warp turtle wave, dude. Why does Kid Boo have the deepest voice? Does he? And that's a lucky defense win right there. But still, Kid Boo's quite ahead here. I think it's like because when uh, when Kid Buu absorbed like a lot of people, he he his voice was obviously like influenced by the absorption. Like Daikayo had a really high pitched voice, so when he absorbed him, you know, Fat Buu became very high pitched. Obviously, thanks for the likes, Spike. Uh, Tom, appreciate it. 18 cleaning house? I don't know about that. <laughs> if you'll uh, direct your attention to the health bars above, you'll see that uh, that is not the case, actually. Mm, big old power blitz. Uh-oh. Oh, I thought that'd be a dragon rush. My daughter's softball team just smoked their opponent 17 to 2. God damn. 
They called the game after two innings. Holy shit. <laughs> Like, all right, we're just calling it. <laughs> it's so funny when they do that in like uh, kids' sports games. They're like, "All right, it's hopeless." <laughs> well, congrats uh, to your daughter, there, Stable. And congrats to you, Papa Scoops. You won. All righty, Revan. Better luck next time, but my, my dude, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, next up, we got Cooler versus Android 17. That's Riku versus Boxy. Okay, we got Cooler with Final Form Supernova, Cooler's Armored Squad, and Cooler's Spaceship versus Android 17 with Energy Field, Nano Machine, Power Save System, and Automatic Restoration. I'm going to use my magical abilities to fix the ring, guys. The ring is going to be back to normal now, all right? Sorry, I was a little lazy about it, but the ring uh, will be back now. Probably for it to just get destroyed again. Here comes the supernova. <laughs> the nightmare has only begun. Hurry up, I got things to do. Ready. <laughs> Oh, that was a good energy shield. Alright, can the savior of the multiverse beat fucking cooler? Damn. Tries for the ultimate twice and misses twice. Ooh, these energy shields are, are, are doing good. Seventeen's doing really fucking good. Yeah, me too, Pixa. I, I always like the androids. And the android saga is my favorite saga in the whole goddamn show, so. Oh. Here I come. And the full stop. Dragon Ball Raging Blast 2, Super Saiyan 2, Vegeta, and Android 18 exchange voice lines if they fight? Really? Super Saiyan 2, Vegeta? Because he fights your Super Saiyan 1 in the show, obviously. You never watch Dragon Ball, steve -O? I guess you don't seem like kind of an anime guy, huh? Yeah. But if you're ever gonna watch an anime, Dragon Ball is the one to watch. Damn, 17 is whooping ass. Ooh. Yeah, it's probably Super Saiyan 1, I would think so. You couldn't get into the fights taking 10 episodes. That's like saying you couldn't take a cake being delicious for like 20 minutes. Like, it was just too delicious for too long, man. I just couldn't take it. Because that's what's great about Dragon Ball is the fights. Well, now the real fight begins. 
it's the it's the android throwdown now. <laughs> I was thinking to myself too, I'm like, in the actual show, seeing 17 throw down with medical or would probably be really cool. It would be it, it'd be a cooler fight, I can tell you that, right? <laughs> Tarble, dude. I do not care for Tarble. I don't at all. I'm sorry. <laughs> Kai! I think he's saying die. Like like die. But maybe it is just like a kind of, I don't know, like attack mantra or something. It's definitely a D, not a K. I know, I, I know nothing about Dragon Ball apart from the death battle, so yeah, take that for what you will. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, it's a it's a really good, really good show. As far as animes go. This cooler's coming back now. Look at him. You know what would be fucking awesome? Breakthrough with Cooler? Yeah, then, then he could do, um... Well, he could do this. It's possible to do this anyway. A Breakthrough on Cooler would be great. With, uh, with Cooler's spaceship. Because then he'd have his full array of abilities with Meta Cooler. Which isn't achievable normally. But with us having the Breakthrough 3, now it is. So, in the future, somebody do Breakthrough 3 with, uh... With Cooler's spaceship, dude. I want to see the Salzer blade with Cooler. Like medical, that would be so great. That would just be the coolest. Well, this could go either way, guys. I don't know, Riku and Boxy on the edge of their seats, I guess, in the future, because they're not here right now. <laughs> I tell you, the best fights happen, and then the people who are involved in those fights aren't even fucking here. It's like 17 might have this one. Oh, yep. Wow, 17. He did it. Work on your skills, man. Work on your skills, man. That's all I'm saying. All right. Congratulations. Uh, Boxy, you're moving on. Better luck next time, Rico. It was a great fight, though. Okie dokie. Next up we got, uh, wait a second. Okay. Yeah, next up we got Captain Ginyu versus Cell Jr. That's HK47 versus Captain Aw. This should be an interesting one. All right, we got Captain Ginyu with, you know, the usual OP Captain Ginyu build Nature of Evil, new style armor, Ginyu Force Badge. Versus Cell Jr. with just the breakthrough. Here we go. Uh, Bill Mack, what's up, dude? Yo, bro, want to ask you something about uh, one of your previous streams. Do you play Kingdoms of Amalur Reckoning game? Or Re-Reckoning? It's Re-Reckoning. Yeah, I stream that every Thursday at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Very fun game. I, I really do enjoy Kingdoms of Amalur. This looks like it's gonna be fun. Yeah! Surprised HK didn't pick an android. He pick, he's picked Cell quite a bit. Got a feeling this is gonna be a long fight. Ooh, Captain Ginyu's defense is insane. Mabel Ruframa, how you doing, GG? Good to see you. Welcome back. Were you there when uh, we won in the first match, GG? Me and you, baby, we won. It was a crazy fight. You should go watch it. Although your fight's going to be coming up real soon. You're going to be fighting again. So. 
Yo, you went back and saw your match? Good, dude. Yeah, that was an epic fucking match. I was so hype about it. Can we to finish KD KOA and uh, start Starfield? Yeah, I don't know what to think about Starfield because it's gotten so many mixed reviews. It's like on one side you got a ton of glitches, a lot of political bullshit, like current day bullshit. But then on the other side, it does look like a pretty interesting game. I don't know, maybe I'll just try it out, you know? Gotta get my own opinion. But then again, you know, 60 bucks. Actually, it's like 80 bucks, isn't it? It's a pretty expensive game. That height advantage. <laughs> Sometimes being a small fighter is a good thing. Dude, I love how Ginyu just kicks him while he's down on the ground. Brutal. Hey, the box. Hey, the box man's won before. That wasn't the first time. Free on Game Pass. Do I look like a console peasant, Steevil? Come on, bro. The Cell Juniors haven't even gotten one health bar down on Ginyu yet, dude. Yes! All right, Pixa, that's it. I'm deleting you out of the out of the tournament, Pixa. I'm deleting you. It's funny. It's funny too, Pixa, because you got seated. You're the only one that got seated in this tournament. You lucky bastard. Oh, Game Pass is on PC too? Oh, I don't know. I don't. <laughs> I, don't I don't have it. I don't have Game Pass, bro. Well, it's only free as long as I pay the Game Pass subscription, right? Like, as soon as I gave up that Game Pass subscription, then it wouldn't be free anymore. So, like, if the subscription is 10 bucks a month, then after eight months, you know what I mean? If I'm only using the Game Pass to get that game, then it's, it, you know, I'm going to be losing money. So it'll probably be cheaper in the long run to just buy the game and not use the Game Pass. I don't know. I guess it depends how often you use it. I really don't have time to play, like, that many new games. You know what I mean? So, there's also that. I'm a console peasant and a PC pe- Okay, first off, there's no such thing as a PC peasant. That's not- a, that doesn't exist. You can't be a peasant for PC. There is only the Master Race. Uh, second... Um... If you're a true PC denizen, then you give up the ways of the console peasant. You know what I mean? Because you realize that once you have a souped up, like, PC, there's no reason to play consoles. Except maybe for exclusives. But no self-respecting gamer buys into, uh, the exclusives culture. You know, like, you're not gonna, like, like, you shouldn't cave to the corporations and, and buy a fucking whole console just so you can play, you know, because that's, that's the only reason things are exclusive, is so that you'll buy the fucking console and spend all kinds of money. Well, there you go. I don't want that multiple bodies. <laughs> Alright, HK, congrats, you're moving on. Sorry, off. Better luck next time, dude. It was it was quite the uh, that was quite the shit show, honestly. Off. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> All right, uh, round two begins now, guys. We're heading to the main tournament stage. Get ready. Ring outs are now going to be a thing for the rest of the tournament. Good luck, everybody. Uh, the first match is going to be Cell versus the Box Man. It's going to be Pixa versus GG Dog. GG Dog. Why do they call him GG Dog, you might wonder? Well, I'm not at liberty to say, you know. Maybe GG will tell you one day. Alright, so we got Cell with Breakthrough Potential, Warrior Genetics, and Piccolo's Regeneration. Versus the Box Man with the same shit as before, of course. Alrighty then.
The preliminaries are over, guys. Let the main tournament begin! Good luck, everybody. Pixa and GG going head-to-head -head in the ultimate showdown, throwdown, mowdown, hoedown. The show starts now. Today the show starts now. Haven't you been torn apart enough today? Yeah, haven't you been torn apart enough today, Pixa? Oh, here we go. He's, he's going right for the perfect form, dude. Oh, so am I. Haha. <laughs> So am I. Da oh, and I missed the ultimate. Oh, God. Ooh, that juggle. Yo, Deb, what's up? Darth Revan, too. Did I make it? No, you're late. You, you missed your match. You missed your match, Revan. I'm sorry. And you lost. See guys, I'm telling you, and, and the statistics show that if you're here for your match, you have a 20% greater chance of winning. I don't know what it is, but for some reason, if you're actually here watching eyes on the screen, you know, it's got something to do with the quantum realm, you know, like quantum physics. If you're watching your match, you're more likely to win it. It's just that simple. So try to show up guys, I'm telling you. Oh, get some, so. Dude, now I'm beating Cell's ass. Like, this is fucking great. Look at how powerful I am, everybody. Come on. Here we go. Come on. Oh, so close. Don't underestimate the box, boys. Ooh! Punched him right into fatigue, too. Oh, shit! Look at that speed, dude. I'm telling you. Cell's speed is incredible. Oh! N nice try, Cell. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh! Right, I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna shut up. Here we go. Try to keep up. God damn, boys. Finally got the ultimate off. Finally. You boys like the Siren Rage Blast? It's pretty strong. Yeah, I take all the rage that's stored up inside the box and I just unleash it for a fraction of a second, okay? It, it, it looks longer than that, but it's really just a fraction of a second is that much power. So imagine if I did it for like a full second. Oh my goodness, the whole the whole uh, planet would just go bye bye. That'd be it, dude. That'd be it. Cell's so still keeping up though. Ooh, missed the old. Uh oh. How did I? What? Oh my God, me! How the hell did you miss when he's fatigued, bro? He was fatigued. Oh no. Oh, I rage and kicked him right out of his ultimate attempt. Holy shit. Oh my god. What is this camera angle? Hello? <laughs> it's like, where'd the fighters go, dude? Hey, Stardust. Good to see you. A lot of people now coming out for the tournament. I love to say it. Love to say it. Oh, that was a good shield. Anyone can win this still, guys. Anyone can win this. Cell is really keeping up. Ooh. Oh my god. Wow, GG, look at this shit, dude. Oh! 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 oh it's over! No! Damn it! That was a nice little warm-up. I mean, it's super perfect sell, man. I got a little more training to do, I guess. <laughs> at least I got the ultimate on him. Damn, GG. I thought we were going all the way to the semis, at least. Oh, well.
Good job, Pexa. Better luck next time, GG. Holy cow is right. All right, next up, we got Omega Shinron versus Kid Goku. That's Timby versus Lord Aizen. Damn, what a match, boys. What a freaking match. Oh, had you on the edge of your seat. See, that's what it's all about, man. That's what it's all about. That's why you guys got to show up for your matches. 100 bucks on the line, dude. And you want to be here for the finals. If you're in the finals and you win, and you're not a 20-plus member, you want to be here or else you can't get the prize money. There's also that. Remember, guys, it's only 5 bucks a month on my Patreon if you want to become a Tournament Plus member, uh, which you can you can do a build. You get uh, early access to choose a fighter. And all kinds of neat stuff, so definitely check it out. Only 5 bucks a month. And, and if you win the tournament, that pays for your subscription more than how many times? Like 20 times over. You're rooting for Omega? Yeah, it is, it is a David and Goliath matchup. It looks even, but remember, Omega only starts off with three, oh, five health bars. He almost got knocked out right there. Oh! Oh! oh. Storg7 donated oh. $69.69. Oh. Oh. oh, boy. Oh. I can't believe we lost. If only we hadn't missed three straight ultimate attempts when Cell was fatigued. <laughs> yeah. At least the box man hit the searing rage blast. Yeah, dude. Good fight and enjoy the rest of the tournament, oh. Rage and Box Brothers. GG, Jesus Christ, man. 69 goddamn box. GG's paying for 69% of the goddamn tournament winnings tonight. Holy shit. Thank you so much, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you, GG. You are the man, the myth, the legend, and yeah, it was fun, dude. Uh, really fun. I hope you pick the box man again, because uh, <laughs> it was really good. It was a good. It was a really good matchup, man. Thank you so much for the donation, the support, man. As always, you know I appreciate it big time. All right, let's check out the bracket. Who's up next? We got. Well, let me do this first. Uh, fucking Lord Eisen just won. Poor Timby, dude. Poor Timby. Moment of silence for Timby. All right, moment's over. So next up, we got Frieza versus Kid Boo. It's going to be Katie versus Papa Scope. Freezy Pop versus Kid Boo. Should be a good one. Oh, I gave Boo the ugly skin by accident. Oh, well. I don't feel like going back and changing it. All right, Katie and Papa, good luck. Yeah, that donation during the ring out, dude. Perfect timing. I was like excited about two things simultaneously at once. It was like 69 bucks, and then that was like an insane ring out. Obviously, the 69 bucks is uh, way more exciting, though. But. <laughs> Bubblegum versus Freezy Pop. Who wins? We were up. We were up two health bars, so that loss was sad, but a uh, good fight nonetheless. And 69 cents. True, true, true. Majin Buu looking like Patrick Star. Yeah, we need to put a Patrick Star skin in the game, guys. Oh. Oh, there you go. Patrick did it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm telling you all, this shit can go quick sometimes. 
All right, congratulations, Papa. Sorry, Katie. Moving on now, the final match of round two is Android 17 versus Captain Ginyu. That's Boxy versus HK. build is pretty good, but if it comes down to attrition, I think Ginyu might have this. We'll have to see. I think, um, though, Android 17 definitely has a lot more pushing potential, so he could very well ring out Ginyu. We're gonna have to see. Nobody calls me Tommy! <laughs> On the ult, dude. My name's not Rick! Up. I got things to do. Ready. 17 is a very busy robot. We got the first blood coming in from HK. Damn. Ginyu's moving quick. Yeah, you just lost, Nabet. You must not have been watching. You see, guys, if you're not watching your match, you're gonna lose. That's just how, how it goes. It's just how it goes. Ooh. 17's really pushing, uh... Ho, ho, ho! Ginyu there. Look at that. Almost. It's, oh, that could have been it. Yep. And there it is. Holy shit. Not bad, I guess. Not bad, I guess. Like, damn, 17 is killing it this tournament. He is killing it, boys. All right, better luck next time, HK. Boxy's moving on. All right, guys, the semifinals are here already. I told you this was a small tournament. We got Cell versus Kid Goku. That's Pixa versus Lord Aizen. One of these four competitors are going to take home the hundo dollars. The hundo shall be yours. Who did I lose to? Uh, you lost to, what was it, Frieza? No, you were Frieza, you lost to Kid Boo. That's who you lost to. All right, Pixa and Lord Eisen, good luck. Man, Pixie, I think you might be taking home the money tonight. But across them fingers. The show starts now. Okay, you're on. I don't know why, but I'm compelled to be quiet for this fight, dude. I love the music, too. Due to me being a jobber in the tournaments, I shall downgrade myself to Busaga slash civilian Yamcha. <laughs> what? Oh boy. Uh-oh. Ooh, that was a good shield. Ooh! Ooh! You better get away from the edge of the ring. Oh! Oh my god. I'd be clenching my butt right now. Ooh, that power pole. Ooh! <laughs> No, Pixa! No! We were this close to greatness! We were so close! 
damn. All right, Eisen. You're in the fucking finals, bro. I don't even know if he's here, dude. He better be. I don't think he's a. Is he a plus member, Eisen? Let me check. Let me double check here. Yeah, no, he's not a plus member, so if Eisen wins the tournament. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, guys, next up in the semis, we got uh, Kid Boo versus Android 17. That's Papa Scoops versus Boxy Stardust. Seventeen been killing it so far. We'll see how he uh, how he does. I'm gonna give him the old cowboy outfit. Bring out City, dude, for real. All right, Papa and Boxy, good luck. I'm trying to decide if I want to try a new idea or go for the win again. I mean, Cell is a great character, man. As you can tell, he's good. It's not, it's, that, that wasn't a lack of the character you picked at all. It was just luck, honestly. Like, he just got too close to the edge of the ring and, you know, Kid Goku pulled the old one-two on you. I have been avenged, but I don't want it to be the power pole, kid. Good try, Pixie. You did well. You did well indeed, man. Oh! He went for the shield, and the warp Kamehameha was quicker. I can't believe that. that that's an attack win. Oh, man. Poor 17. Shit. Good thing my ring is indestructible. Yeah, Boo is on fire right now. Oh my, oh my god. If this comes down to attrition, then Boo is definitely winning. 17's got to get him out the ring somehow. Uh-oh. might be the setup for it. 17's got to move, though. Oh! Oh my god. Wow! Oh my god! He was a... Oh, m look at this! It Damn. The opposite happened. Holy shit. Oh, well, there you go. Okay, what a fight! What what a tournament! It was a pretty. It was a small tournament, but a really good one. A lot of a lot of great key moments there. Uh, so Papa, you're moving on. All right, dude. Papa's the one who gave us the box man uh, in the tournament. So you know he's finally in the finals. I'm very very happy for him. So it's gonna be Kid Goku versus Papa Scoops for the final fucking match. Kid Goku versus Android. Or sorry, versus Kid Boo. Kid Goku versus Kid Boo. I think I, we've had that matchup before. We've definitely had that matchup before. Key moments, yeah, dude. <laughs> I love you guys. All right. Let me get things set up here. Here we go, everybody. The final match, Lord Eisen and Papa Scoops. Who will take home the money tonight? Hopefully one of them will appear in the chat soon. If you guys know them, if you want to tag them in the Discord or something, go ahead, because if they're not here for their match when they win, okay, but they'll still win at least. That is the rule. Because both of them are not Torny Plus members, I don't think. Actually, wait. No, Papa Scoops is. Pretty sure he is. Oh, man, we'll see what happens. Yeah, it was a pretty small tournament, GG. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You got You got to be kidding me. Damn it, Papa! Oh my god. Aizen, if you are here, speak up in the chat right fucking now, dude. Aizen, are you here? Speak up in the chat. You got like um you got less than a minute, dude. You got Oh my god, now Oh my god. That was the quickest win that we've ever had. I not even final. Like that was the fastest ring out I think I've ever seen. Holy shit. Holy shit. Well, there you go, Aizen. Um, you did it, man. You fucking won. Uh, I don't think he's here, though, unfortunately. I don't think he's here. Like, goddamn. Hold up, hold up. But, um, either way, you know, even if you're not here, you're not a Tournament Plus member, and you can't get the prize money, I mean, you still won. And, uh, here we go. You ready? You ready, everybody? Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> All right, congratulations, Aizen! You did it, bro! Oh my god, you did it. You did it. Uh, you're a legend. You won a tournament, Aizen. Uh, it doesn't look like you're here in the chat, though. So, as per the rules, it's listed very clearly in the Discord, guys. You gotta be here. If you're not a Tournament Plus member, you have to be here for your final match in order to claim the money. So, he's not here. He's not a Tournament Plus member. Um, I, I hate to not give someone the prize money, but, uh, you know, maybe I'll talk to Papa Scoop, see about giving him a runner-up or something, because he is a Tourney Plus member, and he did so much for me. Uh, with the box man putting the box man and the different tournament stages into Budokai and all that so I'll, I'll maybe I'll talk to him but but either way you did win Aizen you did win and uh it was quite a tournament at two hundred dollars next month oh my god we'll see we'll see maybe maybe um yeah he just has breakthrough yeah and he won I told you guys it doesn't matter if all you have is breakthrough you can still win a tournament and this is the proof it, you, you don't have to be a Tournament Plus member to win, so sign up, guys, every month, because you could win a hundred fucking bucks. You could win. Anyway, uh, sign-ups for the next tournament will start tonight for Tournament Plus members and a week from now for everybody else. Thank you so much, everybody, as always, for signing up, for being here. Big shout-out to UGG for that 6969. Brother, you are the man. I love you so much, dude, as always. Uh, and big shout out to all my Patreons and channel members and all the Tournament uh, Plus members. You guys make all this possible. So thank you so much, everybody. And until the next tournament, until next time, the Boxman will catch you later. Peace out, guys.